that you don't see, the kind that's hidden under the covers, the kind that is uh, related to what I call the itises, right? The sinusitis, the bronchitis, colitis, uh, and those types of, of, of issues that are chronic, slow, they're over time, um, but in, in, in the end, they'll get you, right? So, um, and I didn't know that the, the food I was eating was causing the bronchitis and the sinusitis and the asthma that was in me. And I didn't approach uh, keto or intermittent fasting to get rid of those. I told you I was totally vain about it. It was about getting in shape. It was about getting my abs back. But uh, six months into it, and I actually we were on a fast with the church, and I was I was praying, and um, realized you know the, the Holy Spirit just kind of spoke to me in that moment, saying, "Hey, guess what? You don't deal with asthma anymore. You don't deal with sinus anymore. All of the medicine I I I had all kinds of meds. I had Sudafed. I had prednisone. I had a butyrol. I had I had it all. I had tried uh, um, Flonase." and nasacort uh and had gotten from flonase and nasacort i actually had gotten infections uh urinary tract infections and that, that's a whole nother story i don't have time to go into it right now but i've told it before and so i had decided that i was just going to live with these these issues and not you know deal with the medicine uh but just that little time into doing ketosis and intermittent fasting and all of those disappears and they were eliminated totally eliminated and and on top of that, my grandmother, um, so, so these, before I talk about her, these, uh, these two, ketosis and intermittent fasting, especially the ketogenic diet, has been shown to have an impact on uh, de neurodegenerative diseases. So things like Alzheimer's and dementia and epilepsy, uh, it has a very uh, significant impacts uh, in a positive manner against these diseases. And so I have these in my family tree as close as my grandmother, my great uh, grandmother and my great aunt. They all had it, right? Uh, so that is my why. This is why I do this. Uh, and the more I research it, the more you know, positive information uh, comes up around uh, these issues that I deal with and that are very close to me, I mean, ketogenic, ketogenic diets are even effective against uh, some cancers uh, as well. Okay, so you think about your why. And